Hello and welcome fellow trainers to another visit to my custom Pokemon region, the Halzari region. Let's go. Halzari region, for those that are new to the channel, has been a series that I have been doing for a while here, last couple months, introducing new Pokemon. Last time on the channel, you got to meet the middle Pokemon in my fire starter line, Flagonal, and I teased you with this image right here, you're going to meet the final evolution of my flying or my fire starter line. My apologies there. But let's go through the line quick just to get a little recap. My fire starter is Cardenber, a nice little cardinal based Pokemon with a little bit of flame to the top feather. And then we evolve into Flagonal, as we just said. So we're getting a little bit of different color variation here. And I think it's now time. Let's meet Cardazeal. So Cardazeal is the final Pokemon in my Fire Starter line. Still clutching that leaf, but now the leaf is growing with the evolution of Pokemon, which I thought would be a very unique and fun concept to play with. As you can probably tell, there's some heavy basis of another character here. If you're new to the channel, you may not know. All of my fire or all of my starters in general, the final forms all have some tie or basis from superheroes. My region is based off the United States of America. Every Pokemon generation for the most part has a unifying idea behind the final forms of the starters. And I went with superheroes because I thought it was a very American pop culture reference that I would would be popular and people would like. And myself, I'm a huge comic book nerd, so I wanted to include. As we go to Cardazeal's Pokedex entry, we see that Cardazeal is the flaming defense Pokemon. It is number six in the Halzari Pokedex. Cardazeal finds balance through the use of its vital leaf. The leaf grows with Cardazeal, creating a shield for the Pokemon's use. Its waxy finish allows for powerful fire attacks and defense. Cardazeal uses that shield for very strong defensive stances for then quick opportunities for powerful attack. That's how Cardazeal really likes to move. That's how they like to attack. Um, Cardazeal, I brought forth all those different colors. It's still got the gray of the unifying cinder wing base of Wagonal, but then it's got that flowing white feather coat to give the impression of white hot heat. You know, kind of what we look at as the hottest achievable flame for the most part is that white hot flame. But then you've got all these different colors of flame going through balanced by that green shield to give it that basis from where it was to where it is now. So I thought that was some really nice unifying themes to Cardazeal that I really wanted to accentuate. As well with that, I've talked about it with Cardenburg. Cardenburg is a very personal Pokemon to me, um, as they all are. But Cardenburg specifically, I've seen, I've heard my mother-in-law speak a lot about, uh, after my father-in-law passed away, how your loved ones come revisit you with cardinals. Um, whether you believe that or not, I thought that'd be an interesting theme to play out, especially with the idea of flame and renewal, such as a phoenix. So I thought that was a really fun idea to play with. And then to have a Pokemon that's so based in the defense and clutching to something that it holds dear, like a leaf from its home tree, would be a very interesting, unique dynamic. So now it's going all the way through from that small bird that clutches that leaf for, you know, the vitality of its own, you know, being to now it's essential to how it, it does every action in life, but it knows how to use it to its own advantage as opposed to just being there since it's always been there. So I thought that would be some very unique concept work to try to play with, with Cardazeal. But that is the full, full starter line. So to recap, we have Cardenber, which is the fire starter, evolves into Flagonal, 
and then finally evolves into Cardazeal. All three Pokemon I'm very happy with, and I hope you guys enjoy as well. But if you've been watching long term, you know by now I'm not done. I gotta ask you a quick question. Who's that Pokemon? So you're gonna meet another regional variant Pokemon you love and know very dear, I'm sure, by that shadow. But it's gonna be a fun variation of the Pokemon a regional variant. So I'm excited to get you guys to see that regional variant next week on the channel. But as always, I want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching these videos. It means a lot to me. If you do like it, come follow me anywhere you can. You can find me Twitch, Discord server here on YouTube. You can follow me on Instagram as well if you so choose. It's all Pokemon Trainer Evan. On top of that, please, if you can, like, comment, subscribe as much as possible, and share this with people you may think would like it. Because I want as many people to see this because I put a lot of work into it. I want people to love it as much as I do. But beyond that, as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you next time. Peace.